relationships move in a direction of harmony. But it's our responsibility to make sure that we're harmonizing. Okay? And so I want to share three things that will help maintain the harmony in our relationships. And then if it's these three things are not um, aligned, if you're not aligned with these three things, then it's going to favor more the disharmony inside a relationship. And so these three basic things is this. The first thing is love. The other thing is forgiveness. And the third thing is truth. If you really think about it, if, you, if some of you maybe have had splits or breakup disagreements or you start finding a lot of uh, conflicts going on inside your relationships, if you get uh, neutral enough and, begin, and really get honest, you can really look at it and be like, dang, there's probably something revolving around the truth, the ability to forgive, right, or the alignment with love. When we're not aligned with love, that's going to, what, shift the relationship. When we don't have the ability to forgive, it's a matter of time for you to exhaust the relationship. And then we're not really open to each other's truths. Then it's going to allow the relationship to evolve on an erroneous foundation. Okay, so it's very important to understand that these three things are the key drivers behind the harmony inside relationships. You've got to be aligned, you know, you got to, the love factor has to be in place, the forgiveness factor has to be in place, and the truth factor has to be in place. And whether or not, it's going to drive the disharmony. It's going to grow the disharmony. It's going to welcome the disharmony. Okay, so really think about like, man, I got all this conflict going on. It seems like the harmony is being disrupted. Look at it as like, you know, am I inviting the truth with my lover? Or am I able to share my truth with my lover? Or am I hiding truths? Okay. Am I in a space where I'm in unforgiveness? I'm not really forgiving them. Okay. And when I say forgiveness, I don't mean that you let them do bullshit. That's not what I'm saying. Okay. Um, then we look at the love. Am I aligned with love? So, the, so am I really allowing the growth to occur with my lover? Am I allowing the growth inside me to happen? Or do I feel like my growth is being hindered, right? Um, do my sense of freedom feel like it's being challenged? Or am I challenging my lover's sense of freedom? See, that's the love alignment fact. I'm just laying some basic things right there to kind of just think about. So the bottom line is this. If you don't you know the love factor, the forgiveness factor, and the truth factor is not strong inside your relationship, is definitely going to push your relationship to disharmony. But if your love factor and your truth factor and your forgiveness factor is strong, then you're going to see that your harmony is going to get strengthened and to evolve and bloom even more. Okay, And then that's where it actually will be um, one of the formulas inside a relationship to give you that healthy exchange and that um, sustainability of what you whatever you have you share with your lover when you have these things in place